Let's take a quick look on how to tell the difference between webbing clothes moth and case making clothes moth damage by examining the frass from each. On the left here we see the lumped excrement, otherwise called frass, from the webbing clothes moth after extensive feeding on a red wool sweater. On the right we see the dry granular frass from the case making clothes moth after feeding on that same red wool. The webbing clothes moth frass is bound together by silk fibers produced by the moth larvae as they feed, whereas the case making frass is comprised of relatively loose fecal pellets that do not stick together.